Hello everyone. I'm Akshay, product manager of integration service. And today I'm going to demo Microsoft Teams, which is our newest addition to Studio Web. For this demo, I'm showcasing a use case, which is a commonly encountered use case, where you want to post a message to a team channel or to yourself whenever a new email is received in your inbox. So we are going to attempt the same today. Uh, how we are going to do that is by using the trigger activity email received, which is a, a Microsoft Office uh, 365 trigger activity. What it does is it will retrieve the trigger, retrieve the newest email, which has come in your inbox. And uh, I'm also using three Microsoft Teams activities, which is get team by name. It helps you uh, retrieve the team record by just providing the team name. In this case, my team name is Avengers. And I'm also going to uh, do the same for channel where I can just provide the, the channel as a name and I'll retrieve the channel record. Why this is needed is so that I can pass the team ID and channel ID to send channel message. So in this case, I will be able to uh, uh, select a particular channel and I'm also going to send the body preview, which is the preview content of my email, which I have just received. So uh, I'm not using any filters as such, but uh, this, this uh, uh, trigger can be easily customized to uh, say a keyword. If you want to uh, just say test, you will be able to use that. But for the simplicity sake, we are not going to do any of that. I'm just using the inbox as my uh, folder. So I, in the, in the real time, this trigger will automatically be triggered whenever a new email comes uh, in your inbox. But for the demo purpose, I'm just doing it manually. So what now will happen is whatever the latest email I have received in my inbox, I should get a message sent to my channel. So uh, it is running. I'm using my demo account. And yes, as you can see, I have received my uh, uh, the, 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 the latest email from my Outlook inbox. And I have also posted a message of the summary to uh, the channel, which I have, again, pre-populated using uh, my uh, activity. Here, I'm using the DAP AKS channel. So if you see in this channel, I have just received a message which is 125, that is now. Uh, In-depth playbook, learn three steps of unified of marketing. Uh, so it's a marketing, uh, basically a campaign. So I'm just going to go to UI part here. And uh, yes, yeah, yeah, this is the one. So this email, I have retrieved the summary. If you want to retrieve the entire uh, uh, message also, that's possible. All you have to do is instead of uh, using preview, you just have to uh, remove and you have to use the entire body, which is uh, if you go to under email received and here you should get, there should be two fields. One is the, uh, the body preview and the other one is the body. So you can just select this and you will be able to retrieve the entire message content also. So as you can see, it's now uh, pretty simple to integrate uh, Microsoft Teams with any of the applications which you already have in Studio Web. And you will be able to now collaborate in a more effective way. Thank you for your patience. Goodbye.